Welcome back. Each year, every year, it seems that everybody comes just a little bit more Polish on Punchki Day. It's a tradition that takes place the day before Ash Wednesday. In this flashback to Punchki Day, Pete Zervakis brings us a refresher on the history of the famous Polish treats. Punchki in what is now Poland date all the way back to the Middle Ages. That's according to the cooking site Mobile Cuisine. Now, as the years passed, punchki became popular as a final hurrah before Lent. People would cook them to use up all the butters, the sugars, the lards in their homes so they wouldn't be tempted to eat that stuff during the fast. Now, traditionally, plum jam and wild rose hip jam were the punchki fillings of choice. But as Polish immigrants came to the United States and they brought the tradition with them, they started using other fillings, maybe modern ones like raspberry and chocolate. It's an art. It's an art form that's been passed on from generation to generation. Challenges is a lot of people don't pass that recipe on down written, so it's kind of like taste this and punch of that, you know, but it's, it's a learning experience. Now the executive director of the Polish Heritage Alliance says the Polish Center in Franklin is one place to get your punchki fixed today. Workers there took pre-orders. Here's video of those beauties being made at Papa's Bakery, which has the Polish Center's exclusive recipe turned out more than 8,000 punchki this year. Pete Zervakis, today's TMJ4.